I can't help it. I It's almost like I'm pretending that you're all here so I can watch your faces as you figure out what's going to happen. And I don't want to tell you because I want you to figure it out. But I have to tell you in order for us to talk about anaphase, what happens? Do you have your prediction in your brain? Is that what you predicted? The event, the single event of anaphase is that sister chromatids are pulled apart to opposite sides of the cell. The sisters. The sisters were connected. Here were the sisters. They were connected to each other. And then those centrioles and spindle fibers pulled them apart. Anaphase <laughs> pulls them apart. Metaphase, they line up on the middle. Anaphase, the sisters are pulled apart. Think about this. Think about how incredible that is. That sister identical copies are connected to each other. In this process, the centrioles and all those spindle fibers attach to the right place in order to pull those sisters apart because the sisters are identical. They're identical DNA. And now you have headed to each pole one complete set of all the chromosomes. Not with too much DNA, with the right amount of DNA. It's headed, that whole thing is headed to the poles. You just split your DNA. Look, I want to tell you something else. What? Me telling you more things? What am I drawing? I'm drawing the centro mirror. The centromeres split. Do you remember how I said? Count chromosomes, count centromeres, and that'll tell you how many chromosomes you have. All along, we doubled our DNA, but we only had one centromere that held them together. As soon as anaphase begins, the centromeres split, and we now have two centromeres where there was one. This is the moment when we double the number of chromosomes in the cell. We had doubled the amount of DNA. That was already done. That happened in S. But this is the point where we double the number of chromosomes. And don't leave it doubled. We've got to finish this process or it's going to be bad news. Now, do you want to go Easter egg hunting for anaphase cells? You know you do. Okay, look from far away. Do you see any that look like they're being pulled apart? Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Remember, the whole thing is a cycle. So you're going to have early anaphase and you're going to have late anaphase. And anaphase is eventually going to sort of look like telophase. And you got to make a call and that's perfectly acceptable. I'm going to zoom in over um, here because I think this is my favorite one. Did you see that one? And if you get too close up to it, you might be like, dude, does it really look like they're pulling apart? But I always get this feeling that it's almost like, you know, they're, they're sitting, they're hanging out together. And then they get pulled and this, there's cytoplasm and they're getting pulled through the cytoplasm. So it's, 
actually like their like there's friction and they're they're getting dragged. They now have, they're shaped like this as they get dragged. I don't even know if you can see that. But they're, they turn into these little Vs as they get dragged through the cytoplasm to the pole. Um, I did see a couple of more in anaphase. Anaphase is fast. I'm gonna, oops. I'm gonna say that this one is in anaphase. Do you agree with that? Doesn't it look like they're getting pulled to the edges? Oh, I'm gonna say this one is also in anaphase. Do you agree with that? We can fight. I'm in. And our I'm I'm always a fan of fighting in a nice way that where we're friends at the end and at the beginning of the fighting. Um because like I said, it's all a phase and so you make a call if you make a call and you have evidence no rigs i think that these guys are pulling apart if you have evidence i'm not gonna like yeah i i see that and you might be right look at this one doesn't that one look like oh man that's a hard one this is an example of Hmm, is that still an anaphase? It kind of looks to me like it's being pulled apart, but it's really long and they're glumped up in the corners, like kind of like a knot. It looks like if that still is anaphase, it's really late anaphase. Would you agree with that? Or maybe it's early telophase. Should we go see what telophase looks like? Okay, let's do. <laughs> 